Alright, let's do whatever ha uh, I can only do a few a few leaps at this point. Yeah. It's kind of a sparse zone where it's easy to go left to right really fast, and I kind of outpaced the rebels to the point where it's a little silly. Whoa, nine travel for four to get rid of four missiles? That's great. Your ship is flooded with advertisement transmissions from nearby merchants. As soon as you arrive in this, this uh, beacon, you will arbitrarily pick one and examine in detail. Yes. Well, now I have too many jumps, making me feel silly about my money usage. I think we're coming up with a big boss fight, and I'm kind of freaked out about that. Defense Drone Mark Three, Mark One. I don't know why I said three. A small NG research vessel is trying to fend off a Mantis ship. You move into engage, but after a quick scan of your ship, the Mantis retreats. NG offers you a schematic and some sweet, sweet scrap. How's our... I should probably just max out our power bars already. Yeah. Oops. There we go. Alright, power bars are maxed out. Our drones can currently handle five. So if I wanted to activate a defense drone, I would have to replace my combat drone. But... Let's see, shuts down incoming missiles, asteroids, flak debris. That could be really good for keeping me alive. Let's put that in the, there and there instead of system repair. I have a lot of NG, so system repair is a little excessive right now. But if I can upgrade my... If I can upgrade my drone system by one, at the cost of... 60 scrap, which isn't too much, but I might not have the opportunity to get that much scrap. Uh, I'd be able to have two combat drones and a defense drone, and defense drone could be a big deal for keeping my... crew alive. Potentially. And whatnot. Um... Ah, uh, we have time to make it to the store. Because the, the rep, we have plenty of time, we just don't have time to go backtrack for a while to do anything special. System repair, 15. Don't really want to sell anything else around here at all, do I? I'm pretty sure I want all these things to stick around. And I want all my weapons, and I want my crew teleporter. No, I'm sorry, got mixed up for a second there. Ah. Uh, I don't think it's gonna happen. Let's just fix up. There we go. So I think we're about to leap directly into the boss fight, if I counted correctly. And either that or there's a whole new system, we don't have to worry about it. But if we are going into the boss fight, uh I can't I can't plan on getting 60 scrap. You arrived at the long range beacon, while the FTL drive is charged, you can jump to the next sector. Hi. You find a space station instead of for travelers. Uh, browse through the listings, you find a tavern of mercenaries for hire, which I can't afford. Shit. You look for potential crew members. <sighs> people with weapon- Yeah, they have skills with the thing- Eh, I have people that already have those skills. It'd mostly just be useful to have another crew member in general, but I just- I don't have scrap, so I'm screwed. Bye. Sorry, everyone. Next sector. The last stand. Yep, I don't get to, uh... There's- I don't think I get to do another system now. Ballistophobia. Oh, a whole playthrough with no, uh, with no missile usage. You arrive at an outpost close to the, uh, Federation base. Your access codes get you past initial security, and an officer sets up a direct feed to the Federation base war room. Admiral Tully speaks first, saying, What's the meaning of this? Who are you? Explain your mission. Your explanation is met with murmurs of cynicism and disbelief among the officers. General Turtsil of the... Uh, NG Brigade speaks up. Intel suggests potential counter to rebel technology. Risk all or save none. Explain the weakness of the enemy fleet, the, re the rebel flagship. Tilly responds, it's settled. The rebels will be here in a matter of moments. We will do what we can to hold off the warships, but you must succeed in destroying the flagship. Your current outpost can provide some repairs and fuel, and the other repair stations can provide aid as well. Good luck. Bam. So, we just got 10 more travel, so it was a mistake to buy travel points, apparently, because we got rewarded 9 and then 10. <laughs> oh, look at this. We get access to a whole system to explore still. Rebels are about to gain control of this beacon. Okay. There's the rebel flagship. So I'm going to want to avoid them as long as possible if I don't want to fight them right away. The flagship will destroy the Federation base if it spends three consecutive turns there. The red rotating flagship icon indicates its position. When the when uh, when the jump line is from the ship is, is solid, it will jump to the indicated beacon that turn. Repair stations repair, partially repair for free. Interesting. 
So it's gonna take a few turns to go over there, and then it's gonna head towards that re repair station. But I can go to repair... Repairs hull and provide supplies. It's interesting. So you can visit various base, uh, repair stations to fix up. There's a base over here. Don't know what that does. Let's start jumping. Let's do it again to get the scrap I want. You arrive in the middle of a raging battle. Both sides are taking off, taking heavy, uh, heavy losses. A small squadron flies past the barrier to break off. Uh, moving towards your position. Right, there's an attack drone. Let's do. Let's activate. Let's try this out. Combat drone, defense drone, pike beam. Oh, who's a dense little ship? Yes, you are. We can make good use of this if I'm very careful. Yes. That's pretty much every part of the ship at once. Burst on their weapons. Ion on their shields. Think we're gonna be good. I'll wait for them to, to fire and then cloak for a second. Cause that's always- that'll be fun. If they even get you- oh, they just fired. I don't think it hit me yet, did it? So... Cloak. Pew! Mid-missed! Alright, that, that's fun to exper- that'll be fun to experiment with. I clearly get to shoot back while it's happening too, which is nice. Uh, I guess I can keep medical turned on right now because the power is not being used for anything else at the moment. Oh, because it was being applied to cloaking. Maybe I should leave that sitting for now. I don't know. It, it, oh, that's oxygen crap. Let's ignore that. That just happened. Oh yeah, they're gonna be in a bad way real soon here. Cause I got a scary laser. Go laser now! Yay! It happened. So what happens here is that every time that the cloaking fires, like I go into this uh, ion mode. It's like as if I got hit by an ion cannon, where the weapon's disabled for a while. Basically, the basically it has a cooldown. Cool, defense drone took out the enemy missile that was coming in. Wow. We're ripping him apart right now. Yeah, that wasn't even a contest. Alright, that's... And there's 40 scrap. Wow, we are set up right now. I'm excited. We don't even need a repair right now. Let's just move forward. Just keep visiting systems. We're essentially trying to grind before the big boss fight, if we can. You scan the area, finding uh, signatures for only a small trade vessel. However, as it approaches, you see a silhouette of a rebel scout! You run the scans again and discover the registration is fake. You, fake. you move in to attack. Hi, bad guys. Pike. Laser on the weapons, iron on the shields, combat, defense. Let's make a mess, and I'll cloak with the moment I see them shoot. Just to avoid any missile damage that comes our way, as we're working on disabling them. Aha! Their incoming ion blast was, avo was avoided entirely, and our drone will hopefully stop their incoming missile. God damn, this ship is set up. It's probably gonna get completely dismantled by the alien cruiser. The alien flagship. Alright, we're not really taking him out much faster though. The lack of offensive drones is probably not great. But at least we're avoiding their incoming missiles. So far. Yep, I saw that ion blast coming and I evaded it. Maybe he'll give me enough scrap for me to upgrade my drone system. Oh, we took a hit. We have taken a hit. Not appreciated, sir. He's taking more. My, my defense drone didn't save me from that one, I guess. Oh, I cloaked too late for that, didn't I? Oh well. We survived, at least. Wow, 74 scrap. I guess if you make it this far, they just want you to have all you need. Alright. I'm happy. Yeah, one more upgrade to, to our drone compartment. And we can man all of them at once. That's exciting. Power management will be an issue, because we can't get any more power. It's maxed out. That's a little rough. Cloaking increase its duration? Absolutely. But it requires more power. Damn it, that's gonna be the downside of this, huh? Is I'm gonna require more and more power to make certain things work the way I want them to. So many things require so much power. Alright, I'll probably end up reducing my engines the rank to, to compensate. We'll see how it goes. 
Don't need repairs right now, so I think I'll keep hopping around. I want to see what happens when I go to the base. Federation ships are scarce in this region of space despite a number of civilian uh, stations. You see a small bomber squadron engage in some Feder Federation scouts and quickly move to, in to assist. Hello, friend. You have... Are those just laser rifles? I think those are just laser rifles. I don't think a defense drone will help me because it only does missiles. Alright. I'll get ready then. Pike beam. It's just a fun weapon to have. First, I. Nope. Ion. Put one more point into our cloak. Wait for them to fire. Aha! Who's not hitting me at all? You're not hitting me at all. And they might be kind of disabled by the time they get a chance to fire again. Their weapons are already under fire. Oh yeah, they're gonna be in trouble. There we go. Our laser cut them apart. Combat Drone Mark One, another one. Huh. First of all, that's a lot of scrap. That's good news. Uh, don't know what I'm gonna do with so many freaking combat drones. I could equip all three of them at once and just have a flurry of attacks. The downside is I don't think I can change my drone usage in combat. So I can't know in advance if they're gonna have missiles for me to shoot down, and I should shoot their missiles down, because that's the weakness of having a shield-based ship, is that I can't... Uh, ...fight back against their shields. Um... I don't even know what I want to upgrade at this point, honestly. I could go further into cloaking, so that if I- if, so that if I want to, I can make it last 15 seconds. Let's do that. Let's just do that already. And once I get one more scrap, maybe I'll upgrade my piloting? That seems like a decent thing to do. This way, if my if uh if they damage various systems and I I can re I can reroute the power to clo to cloaking and just do a, a long 15 second cloak for example, is my thought process. Let's see. Stations repair you bases. It's the Federation base, right? This is the place we have to defend. I think let's just intercept the ship. Let's see what happens. Ah. <laughs> I don't know how many more upgrades I'm gonna get, and I'm fully healed right now. This is my best chance, probably. I can try to hurt it a lot. And, uh... If we're truly screwed, and I get if I recharge in time, we might be able to run away. This is it, the Rebel Flagship. If you're able to destroy this monstrosity, the, the Federation fleet will have a chance of surviving. There's no turning back. Did it cloak? It totally has cloaking. Well, shit buckets. Alright, um... No. Uh, two of those. Combat is powered up. Oxygen's fine right now. All of my ships are ready. I'm gonna wait for him to shoot at me, and then I'm gonna cloak too to counter him. Let's see, I can't even see the inside of his ship right now. Let's wait for the cloak to wear off, since ion blast. All these things take a while to fire anyway, right? Yeah, I can't even target him. Do I want to take a point out of anything? Maybe I should go further into cloaking? Let's see, one, two, three... Uh... How many powers is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, that's, that's the right number. Shield is up. I don't have any more power. I think I'm just gonna keep it where it is right now. Let's see. How much... Every point of this is like... It's like five dodge, right? I think I will invest further into cloaking. All right, wait for the incoming attacks to happen. Robotic warfare, achievement unlocked. Come get me, bro. I'm waiting for those big scary blasts. All right, we're attacking now. So ion blast his shields. Burst late. Oh, there's so many weapon departments to attack too. It's probably best to try to attack each one though. Pike beam. Yes, that's three. That's two of his other shields and his shields. I mean, two of his other weapons and his shields and his piloting department. All right, getting ready. I'm getting ready to cloak. Watching, watching for incoming attacks. Here they come. 
Oh, did they just dest they destroyed my, my defense drone? That's not good. Um, rebuilding after unexpected destruction. Well, crap. Didn't realize that was it. Could didn't really know how it gets shot down. Wow. Whoa! I actually got my attack in. My pike beam actually got his attack in already. Multiple of their attacking. Whoa! A bunch of their attacks are down right now. That's crazy. That's fantastic. Um. We could use a heal though. Um, yeah, we'll reroute power a little bit because our drone our drone is down. Who's most hurt? Jesse. And Jones up here. Yeah. Let's have you. Shadow's gonna come over to help with repairs. Oh my God, we are under attack. Serious attack happening right now. These characters try to repair. All right, this is where I get stressed out. Ha ha ha. Defense drones are back up. Uh, let's get that back up then. Defense drone are activated. We have some repairs to do right now. Oh shit. Uh-huh. A little freaked out by how much stuff's going on at the same time. I want to take out the fire, and I want to repair. Oh, they're cloaking. It's gonna be a little while before our cloaking is ready again. Here, get up there to repair. Get the cloaking ready. Quickly. I still ioning. Huh. There we go. They it got, it got back in, in place just in time. Everyone get back to their normal positions. Our shields are severely wounded right now. Um... Shit. <laughs> Boom! Oh, they took out my defense drone again, damn it! And the laser didn't work because their shields were up. Damn it. There's a lot going on at once right now. This dude's fucking scary, man! I don't like it. Stop it. <laughs> Stop being scary. Quickly. Exhaust this problem. Let's see, this thing's taken out, uh... Sorry, Burst Laser, you should go after this guy next. No, actually, Burst Laser should probably just directly attack their shields. If we can... Oh, no, that's not good. I'm thinking if we can directly obliterate their shields, then we can continually hit them with the Pike Beam, which is probably the best thing I have. Oh, here they come. What is that exactly? I don't know. It's green. My it's my stuff's not active yet. I'm just gonna have to, I have to take the hit. Did we just get better at piloting in this moment? <laughs> so let's just max out his piloting skill. Woo! Now let's try not to die. Um, help out down here. We need our med bay functioning. That's how we don't die. All right, watching for next big. Laser's probably bad. Let's avoid that. Did I even avoid that correctly? Shit. Defense drone activate. For love of God. I'm getting a little overwhelmed here. I'm trying not to, but I totally am. I'm trying to take out their shields is not really working out right now. Let's just try to repair things. Which one is this, Jesse? You're the weapon specialist? Shield specialist, and you, which was this guy? Jones? That's the weapon specialist, so you go after the weapons, you, you'll go repair camera. Shadow is the repair specialist. No, you go there. Never mind. You go back to shields. <sighs> she shields alive so far. And if our pilot goes back, we can jump. And I don't know if this is true, but I imagine, I imagine that his dam the damage probably stays the same. So if we if we fled away from here, we could probably escape. And if we escaped, we could probably come back with repairs and try to take him on again. I think that's probably how this works. Everyone should just be back at their normal station if they're not already. Oh crap, never mind. Right about the cameras. Uh... Ooh, we did- we did pike damage! Yeah! That's proper damage all across their ship. So their shields were finally down. Uh, we're almost- we're not even close to ready to, uh... To use our cloaking yet. Oh, uh, they're cloaked now. So we can't fire on them right now. Uh, come on, and cloaking. Okay, that's not good. Help out with the O2. We need that to be working. They don't invade you at all, which is a bit of a surprise. Let's see if we can rearrange this a little bit. 
Were they just- they were firing on us just now, right? Oh, evasion. Yes, we dodged it. There we go. This is tense, it has two health left. It has two health left. Uh, oxygen's down. Get out of that chamber. Oxygen's repaired, at least. Um... Cloaking's very down right now. I don't- I don't think I want to re redistribute my power at all. Whoa, he's close to being down. I just realized he's down to one hole. Oh my god. Oh my god, I beat him. Just as you finally gain the upper hand, it finds a way to make an FTL jump. Shit. You've gotten to- uh, you gotta keep up your assault. Only 29 scrap for that? That's the hardest thing I've ever done. Fuck nuggets. All over the place. Fuck. Well, shit. Uh... He's going for the base, that son of a bitch. God damn it, he's going for the base! Let's see... He'll destroy the base if he spends three consecutive turns there. One... Two... Three... Yeah, I can't repair. Shit. I have to follow it to the base. Oh, you bastard. Well, chunks of it are blown off, right? How, he, he has to be easier now. He has fewer weapons. You chase down the flagship and discover it's heavily damaged from the previous fight. Scans indicate it has redirected considerable power to its drones. Get ready for a fight. Shit balls. Shit balls. All up in the balls. So much shit balls. Um. We can. Who? Take out his drone, drone controls. Very carefully aim this. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. No. Can I do slightly better than that? Ah. Uh, not really, no. I'm not gonna hit both those at the same time. Might be able to hit that one? Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six chambers at once with the laser. We're gonna do our best to hit the freaking drone control, because that's what it's focusing on now with its reduced weapon power. Uh, cloaking is probably going to be less effective with all those drones attacking me at the same time, right? Let's reduce power to cloaking and increase power to evasion, since they're focusing on that now. Make sure everyone's back at their normal stations. Oh yeah, those are attack drones all over the place. That's going to be a problem. So increased evasion probably will significantly help me out here. Shit. This is scary. He has defense drones too. This is scary. Oh shit. Should have been watching. Uh, shit. We avoided that a little bit, but. Power surge detected. Shit. Ah ha ha. I'm worried about things right now. I'm trying to take out the. Oh god, there's so many drones. Yes, everybody. I think everyone shooting at their drone thing is probably the best call right now. Cause there's a lot of drones coming at me at the same time. Shit. He's damaging my weapons. Nope, they're back online now, though. There we go. Jesus. Ah, uh, medical bay's down. Shadow Scythe. Yeah, let's get re medical repaired. Oh my goodness. There's a lot happening at once. Ooh, did we just disable the drones? We disabled some of their drones, at least. These look gray. Yeah. The defense drones are still on, I think, but not their offensive drones. Most of our systems are still on. Ooh, incoming missiles that I can't dodge. Shit balls. All right, uh... Quickly get in there and try to... We need to put out the power so bad. We need to put out that fire. Power search detected. Okay. People go to the normal positions, but you stay here, because you're dying. I'm trying to my best to take out their drones. Um... Let's go on ion blasting their shields now. Fuck! This is a mess. The drones are back. I'm waiting for the- yep, there's the missiles. 
They hit me anyway, shit. Um, I think they hit me anyway, unless they got- unless they got- that might have been interrupted by my defense drone. Um, 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 um. All weapons are still active. I don't know if that's the best approach or not. Should I be taking out their weapons specifically now? Maybe the pike beam should be best aimed across here. And the burst laser on their drones and the ion on their shields. Maybe burst laser on their shields. Everything focused on their shields to take them down so our drones can actually do damage. And then hopefully the, we'll outpace their drones, I don't know. He has more things that, I that I'd want to take out than I have things to attack him with, basically. Holy shit, he's down. Pike Beam is amazing! Just as you finally gain the upper hand, it finds a way to make an FTL jump, because of course it does, you son of a bitch. Gotta keep up the assault. Tell me I can repair somewhere! He's going away. One, two... He takes time to jump around, right? Surely I can get to the repair station to help out. Please. Ha 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 ha, I've been playing for like three hours now. Steals it. Whoa. Stumble uh, across a rebel ship distributing supplies to local civilian colonies. It's probably not anything military grade, but every little bit helps. Um, steal supplies from the civilians. Attack the rebels. I don't want to fight right now. I'm gonna steal. I'll do that. Shit. Colonists are willingly to give you the supplies, but as you make the jump away, it ex explodes. An explosion rocks your ship. It was trapped. Son of a bitch. Well, that's not gonna help us make friends. Obviously. The medical base not even powered right now, shit. I forgot. <laughs> Everyone heal up, damn it. Poor guys. Get in there. You get in there. Shit. So much crazy micromanaging. <laughs> nah, bro, it's cool, I got it. I am so close to dying. That's why we're going this way, though. Yeah, he's gonna spend two- it's gonna- he, he, he'll spend one turn trying to get there, so I should have time to get back. I should be good. I should be good. Alright, everyone back to your positions. I really like the ship. I like how compact it is. It's a nice construction shape. Alright. Power down medical, so we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can keep medical up for a second. I need six for these guys. Yeah, I need six for those guys. Should be good to go. Let's get repairs. Really hope I'm not miscounting something. Ah, 15 whole points repaired. Supplies of various kinds. There's a mobile ship construction platform station at this beacon. After a brief exchange, they give you a clearance to receive emergency repairs and military supplies. Ship. Feels the oxygen in your ship. Med bay. Just need to make up my mind of what I want to spend here on the Excelsior. <laughs> I keep forgetting it's called that. It's great. It's great. It's great. Uh, auto evasion would be good for when the pilot has to move. Do I have any reason to increase my drones? One, two, three, four, five, six. No. Yeah. Oh, my weapons and everything are upgraded. Fine enough. So more system power is not a useful upgrade right now. A healing boost would not hurt at all, because it affects the whole ship. I, I hope that affects the part that also affects your whole ship. I don't know how you would tell. Let's see. Yeah, at a reduced speed. I assume it's a percentage of the current speed, so if I upgrade it for the whole ship, it'd probably help everywhere. Bonus shields, I'm not going to be able to afford power for that. Bonus dodge wouldn't hurt, but I'm unlikely to use it. Let's go for the... Yeah, but the med bay thing would still require more power. Seeing enemy weapon charges would help me see the incoming attack to get ready to cloak. And auto evasion would help if anything happens to my pilot. Yeah. I'll go for those. I'll enable the med medical bay upgrade in case I feel like it's necessary. Ah, <sighs> we've actually very nearly maxed out every meter on that entire thing, practically. Um, but yeah, now I should be able to see the, uh... Now I should be able to see the enemy charging rate, so I have a better idea of when I need to cloak. One, two, three, four, five, six... Do I want to redistribute? For now, we should add to m there, so... There we go. 
Get our cloaking ready for the next big fight. <sighs> Shit. They're about to gain control of that system. That'll delay me. Gotta go for it. Just gotta be prepared for a fight. Well, shit. Rebel fleet has found you, and, our, and a nearby scout turns to engage. The cruisers in the distance are firing on you. Shit balls. This affects my FTL charge speed, so I should probably get further into that. What the hell are all these things? Are those? Oh, those are. I thought they had like super like weird rect like rectangular freaking drones. Let's decrease power to weapons. Two more in there. Yeah. I'm gonna try to just escape at this point. So... Combat drone, defense drone, but otherwise more points into this to increase our charge rate. And I'm gonna do everything I can to just defend myself. If I can stall for long enough, we can hopefully charge our FTL drive. Which is now going at double speed. I just want to jump out of the system and get away so I can fight the flagship with as, taking as little damage as I can. That's why, I'm, that's why I'm prioritizing defense drone right now. Make sure everyone's at their normal positions. Their shields are currently charging. Try to keep an eye on that. Oh right, I didn't tell you guys to attack something. Can I eye on their freaking weapons? Because that'd be fantastic. Here it comes. Cloaking! Cloaking for as long as possible. Go, go, FTL drives, go! Come on. Oh, ASB target locked. I don't even entirely know what that means, and I don't like the sound of it. Hit out of here. Fuck all y'all. Alright, I think, I mean, rule of threes, right? This is probably the last fight. Holy crap, it is damaged. You're not certain how it's able to keep fighting with the amount of damage it has sustained. It looks like it's transferred power to the teleporter as well as some kind of super weapon. Be prepared, this is it. Okay, that's that's clear. Where's its super weapon? It's going for teleporter and super weapon. Where is its super weapon? It has two normal guns. The, oh, it doesn't have a drone arm at all, so we don't have to worry about that. Let's see. Combat and defense drones are active. Pike beam is active. Uh, right. Our cloaking is still on, is still on cooldown. That's not a very encouraging thing to deal with right now. But we gotta wait for it. Um, what is your what's Jesse's effect on shields? Faster recharge rate. I think I want Jesse preemptively in the door compartment if they're gonna try to ma uh, if they're gonna try to jump on me. Set up our pike beam to hit all of these at once. Actually, it might be better at this slightly different angle. Yes, it'll take out their med bay and yeah, I want to take out their teleporter as best as I can. Ion blast their that's their, sh that's their shields. First laser their teleporter to stop that. All right, good luck me. Hope this works out. They're planning on boarding me, so my plan is to specifically be, spe be specifically in that field because th th this will make our doors more powerful. There we go. Now we can try to drown them out. Hopefully, weapons are their weapons are charged. I don't have the power yet though. Just have to take that first hit. Ow, that's bad. Those guys are drowning, hopefully. Um, let's get you to help out with the fire. Intruders detected. Yeah, I know. I know, buddy. Let's get you out of the out of that department before it comes a problem. Uh, <laughs> there's a lot to keep track of right now. They're attacking my cloaking. Did they just attack me? Oh shit, they did. Cloak. Ooh. Oh, they invaded my freaking bridge. That's bad. No, stay put, buddy. Oh, Jesus Christ. Um, I don't know if I can deal with this kind of invasion. It's kind of annoying they seem to have magical invading parties that aren't part of their crew. Because th those guys weren't on here. They're just spamming free... They get free units to attack me with. Alright, let's, let's get into the med bay. 
Um, is the pike beam down? It is. They're attacking my weapon systems, which is bad. I need power to med bay. Because, yeah, pike beam's not going to be active for a little while. Only so much we can do. Everyone get in this department. You're all- you're healthy at the moment. Fight while we can. They're- they're taking damage. At least they're taking damage. Let's- let's reassess here. Their teleporter's down, which is good. Let's f focus on their shields next. I do want their pike beam- the pike beam up, but... Th those guys have to- have to suffocate first. There we go. Oh man, there's a lot going on right now. <laughs> My shield, all right, my shields are down, which is really bad. They're gonna shoot me soon. Oh, one, one of their weapons is down at least, though. My defense drone can hopefully help us still. God. Did they invade me again? No, that's the power surge. Okay. Um. Their shields are going down. Holy shit, am I winning? This is chaos. Hey, Solus just got better at fighting people by punching them in the face really hard. Thank, thank God for drones, huh? Ooh, that's bad. Can't do much about that, though. Yep, just just taking the hit. <gasps> Whoa, we beat it! Holy shit, I just beat the game on easy. <laughs> Quote unquote easy mode. Fuck me. That's satisfying. All right, let's deal with our repairs now. Oh, but never mind. Thanks to the valiant effort of the Excelsior. And her successful crew, Solus, Shadow, Jesse, Jones, and Vincent. Three named characters and two randoms. The Rebels' flagship was destroyed, throwing their feet into chaos and ensuring a Federation villa, uh, victory. Game by Subset Games. Created by those peeps. It really is just like a couple people, isn't it? Yeah. Alright, guys. I- wow. I beat FTL on easy. Oh. I think it usually takes people more attempts than that, doesn't it? That was my fifth attempt. I don't know. It is RNG, so who knows? I could have just gotten lucky, or I may have gotten made some really good decisions in there somewhere. Uh, I know that some people say they beat the they played the game like a do dozens of times and never beaten it, so that was a big surprise for me. Shit. All right. Well, this is our ongoing Patreon-sponsored series. No, it's not over. I'm still playing it for all of April. My general approach is that I tend to make 30-minute episodes, so um, usually what I do is I. What I, what I did for the last two episodes is I made one episode, and then I pretended I made 30-minute episodes out of it, so I was like, I skipped the next day. I think I'm- I'm not sure yet, I might have taken this particular playthrough you're watching right now and split it into multiple episodes, because it's so long! But yeah, once this run goes through, I'm sure I'll play more FTL throughout the month. God damn. This game's a time investment. Surprisingly big time investment for a permadeath game. Alright. Thanks for watching like always, guys. I'll see you next time in the next episode. Playlist in the description and all that. I don't know, maybe I'll try... I'll probably either turn on advanced mode or try the stealth ship. Or turn on normal mode? I'm not sure. I don't know. I feel like I'm barely made it, so I don't know if I'm ready for, for normal yet. But advanced might be the next thing to do. See you guys next time.